I have not failed. I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work. Many of life's failures are people who did not realize how close they were to success when they gave up. We often miss opportunity because it's dressed in overalls and looks like work. 5% of the people think, 10% of the people think they think, and the other 85% would rather die than think. The three great essentials to achieve anything worthwhile are, first, hard work, second, stick to itiveness, third, common sense. Genius is 1% inspiration, 99% perspiration. If we all did the things we are really capable of doing, we would literally astound ourselves. When you have exhausted all possibilities, remember this, you haven't. Nonviolence leads to the highest ethics, which is the goal of all evolution. Until we stop harming all other living beings, we are still savages. Our greatest weakness lies in giving up. The most certain way to succeed is always to try just one more time. To invent, you need a good imagination and a pile of junk. Negative results are just what I want. They're just as valuable to me as positive results. I can never find the thing that does the job best until I find the ones that don't. There are no rules here, we're trying to accomplish something. The doctor of the future will give no medication, but will interest his patients in the care of the human frame, diet, and in the cause and prevention of disease. Just because something doesn't do what you planned it to do doesn't mean it's useless. I have friends in overalls whose friendship I would not swap for the favor of the kings of the world. I never did a day's work in my life, it was all fun. Restlessness is discontent and discontent is the first necessity of progress. Show me a thoroughly satisfied man, and I will show you a failure. We are like tenant farmers chopping down the fence around our house for fuel when we should be using nature's inexhaustible sources of energy sun, wind, and tide. I'd put my money on the sun and solar energy. What a source of power. I hope we don't have to wait until oil and coal run out before we tackle that. To do much clear thinking a person must arrange for regular periods of solitude when they can concentrate and indulge the imagination without distraction. Unfortunately, there seems to be far more opportunity out there than ability. We should remember that good fortune often happens when opportunity meets with preparation. Everything comes to him who hustles while he waits. I find out what the world needs. Then I go ahead and try to invent it. There's a way to do it better, find it. He had all the attributes of a perfect man, and, in my opinion, no finer personality ever existed. I never did anything worth doing by accident, nor did any of my inventions come by accident, they came by work. The first requisite for success is the ability to apply your physical and mental energies to one problem incessantly without growing weary. I am proud of the fact that I never invented weapons to kill. Being busy does not always mean real work. The object of all work is production or accomplishment and to either of these ends there must be forethought, system, planning, intelligence, and honest purpose, as well as perspiration. Seeming to do is not doing. Nearly every person who develops an idea works at it up to the point where it looks impossible, and then gets discouraged. That's not the place to become discouraged. All Bibles are man-made. We will make electricity so cheap that only the rich will burn candles. There is no expedient to which a man will not go to avoid the real labor of thinking. Nature is truly wonderful. Only man is truly foul. Opportunity is often missed because it comes dressed in overalls and looks like work. A good intention, with a bad approach, often leads to a poor result. I am not discouraged, because every wrong attempt discarded is another step forward. 
Being busy does not always mean real work. The object of all work is production or accomplishment and to either of these ends there must be forethought, system, planning, intelligence, and honest purpose, as well as perspiration. Seeming to do is not doing. If we did all the things we are capable of, we would literally astound ourselves. It is astonishing what an effort it seems to be for many people to put their brains definitely and systematically to work. Many people who fail are people who did not realize how close they were to success when they gave up. So far as the religion of the day is concerned, it is a damned fake. Religion is all bunk. It's very beautiful over there. I have never failed, I've only shown the way I did it before doesn't work. I haven't failed, I have just found 10,000 ways that won't work. I told I was going to record talking, and then have the machine talk back. He thought it absurd. However, it was finished, the foil was put on, I then shouted, Mary had a little lamb, etc. I adjusted the reproducer, and the machine reproduced it perfectly. The chief function of the body is to carry the brain around. There is no substitute for hard work. Blah 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 I know right. Many of life's failures are people who did not realize how close they were to success when they gave up. Personally, I enjoy working about 18 hours a day. Besides the short catnaps I take each day, I average about 4 to 5 hours of sleep per night. Anything that won't sell, I don't want to invent. Its sale is proof of utility, and utility is success. A genius is often merely a talented person who has done all of his or her homework. When I have finally decided that a result is worth getting, I go ahead on it and make trial after trial until it comes. I believe that the science of chemistry alone almost proves the existence of an intelligent creator. Hell, there are no rules here, we're trying to accomplish something. Which quotation do you like the most? Don't forget to subscribe.